When I first came, there were very few street children, and it was around the late 1990s, early 2000s, when the conflict was at its height. There was a huge mushrooming of numbers. They were everywhere. We have no choice. We have to keep hope. But we don't think that the problem of street children will be addressed properly uh, in near future. They just think about how to survive now, how to get money for one hour to take a drug or to live, you know. They don't have a vision of their life. They don't have aim, nothing. They are just waiting for die. That's it, I think. I just to Yuba of Stago Bectile, I live at a tanky, Akno Soma, Rutanagi, Parts of Varum, Rutan Possi, Akno, and Lamo Soma, Soma, and Militan, Dere Kuraru, and Dere Porivatan Gonsaginsa, Botsar Golagi, Unor Lai Porivatan Gonmanagi, this lesson, but a cult of Herno and Ilagra. Molitan Tespati, Botsargo, Testa Halgo, Lady Botsargo, and Militan, some column tanks regarding. They have a violence in home, not good environment. Kids run away to better life, to find a better place. City is the dream, and they don't know the realities. City is a hell, you know. We from the NGOs and civil society, we work on a small way, but the issues has to be tackled by the government. And the government is still now is totally ignored on that street children. I have not seen any plans and policies for the street children as well. How can a small NGO and civil society tackle that the big problems from our country? I think as with most developing countries, there's a period of chaos and, and things not working very well, which has to be gone through. But at the moment, they're still very much at the bottom of the mountain. Oh, my God. 